Okay, just real quick. Hi, everyone. Uh, we're having a family, you know, Thanksgiving, and we're gonna give thanks in the most primeval form, which is life eating for the piranha juveniles, as well as the adults, and then some caribas. Right. That's uh, that's a uh, yeah. Well, that's all over. Yeah. I thought you said they weren't aggressive. Oh, oh, they're pretty aggressive. But the other guys are even more aggressive. See how the pack shares? Yeah. They exchange this look. They're still carrying it around, and everyone gets a bite. Uh -huh. Just to make sure that the pack stays yeah. strong. If you see the biggest piranha, I need not to run a cannon and then the rest of them are balls. <laughs> Switch real quick. Yeah. Well, Welcome. <laughs> wait, wait, no cannons in that pig. I forgot. Here, you go. Here, come sit with me. You sit that's there. That's cannon. That's cannon. Do you see him? That's where my finger is. Yeah, that's cannon. No, come here. He's gonna. You're gonna sit here. All right, time for the adults. That's canon. Yeah, but many people. Did you name any others? Did you see the other ones are balls? Yes. Yeah, like cannonballs. Cannonballs. All right, time for the adults to indulge in a fresh chub. Thanks to Mother Nature. Chopped it himself right here. Okay. And again, we'll find them shortly. Interesting how they're always able to find the spot. Would he hide? Yeah, yeah, he's over there. It's it's always the same spot. Eventually, they sniff him out and they pull him out. Oh yeah, there push him out. There he is. You can zoom in on this stuff. I guess that's it. It's a quick. Hey, where'd you get these? These are big. Yeah, I got these tiny, quarter inch, like this big, and I grew them all the way to this big. Yeah. Oh, these are your original. Originals, yeah. The OG Ranas. <laughs> so yeah, this this is a uh, close cousin to the red belly, but they say everyone says they're more aggressive, and let's see uh -huh. if they live up to their name. They're all ready. Stars. 
going. They ain't allowed to get food. <laughs> Not always. No. No, the one guy gets the food. Not always. Yeah. Sometimes, you know, sometimes they get more, sometimes they get less, but that's what keeps them fit and interested. Otherwise, yeah. they get lazy and stuff and, yeah. you know. Yeah. If they got too much. Or... Right. It's like the wild. Sometimes they exactly. eat. Exactly. Exactly. This is, the carnivorous diet is based on the wild feeding, not just the ingredients, but the way you apply the food as well. Yeah. And that's what keeps the fish in its best, you know. Nature knows best. <laughs> That tank looks like you're going to have to clean it. Right. Oh, it'll settle and the canister filter will take care of the, you know, yeah. the breeze and uh, yeah, it won't be good for about a week. But they have to get fed twice, twice or three times a week, otherwise you'll face cannibalism. They could kill each other. Oh. Kill, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, Do you well. have certain days you feed them? Um, no, just evenings. I usually prefer evenings. Evenings? Yeah, seems to be a, a much better way to, you know, record everything because there's a lot less, a lot less lighting. And, and how about him? That's a master. Yeah, does he get fed? And... He gets fed usually same two, three times a week, but he gets like worms and other things, you know, shrimp, cut up shrimp or whatnot. Is he aggressive? Yeah, he's yeah. very aggressive and he'll jump out. I'm trying to get you every time. They'll even bite your finger, They'll but bite your it's finger, not that right. painful. They'll even try to get your finger, but it's not that painful. Yeah, I just cleaned the tank so he knows it's me. He wants to, he wants to Whoa. <laughs> and then it always hurts, too. <laughs> Nothing. He just no. put his finger oh. on finger. All right, my friends. Well, last night, as you saw, we had uh, family members over and I used them <laughs> for a quick experiment to show them or present them with the, uh, you know, unprecedented ability to witness piranhas at their best. And obviously the adults with a terrifying spectacle, as my aunt have uh, <laughs> mentioned. Um, and of course, some very interesting question that arrive every time you see some, something like that, such endeavor, is how often do you do this? And, everything else, any dangers involved and so forth and so on. You know, it is really amazing or fascinating to see these guys do what they do. And I have to say, each time, and I've seen it uh, dozens, dozens of times now, each time is something to observe anyway. So I can only imagine how it is for someone who has witnessed it for the first time on their own. And well, you saw the reactions, you heard the questions. It is something fascinating, I tell you, my friends. So. That's it for this one. If you are new here, please subscribe, ring the notification bell, and uh, we'll see you on the next one.